my beauty shines from within. Yay. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing when I was writing these, but it was fun writing these. I always like writing these before I do like my readings and stuff. That's how I come up with titles and find out what's going on. Okay, they have the Hermit in Reverse. So there's no tradition, no wedding here. We have the Nine of Wands with a Deference or Overcoming Obstacles. We have the Three of Cups in Reverse with no friendships, no celebration. We have the Ten of Swords with Exhaustion and Resolution. We have the Four of Cups in Reverse with no offers and no loneliness, but we have the Three of Wands with not seeking direction and no partnership. Okay, so the budget for this wedding is $81,841. That could be anywhere up to this amount or lower than this amount. The ring has three stones. It has a bevel set, so there's two pieces to this ring. We have a basket setting. We have an antique setting. We have one of those Irish promise rings. I always forget what they're called. And then we have the channeled setting. And then we have yellow and light blue masquerade ball wedding theme. That's fun. And then we have cake and food. We have uh, chocolate peanut butter graham cracker butter cookies. Uh, graham cracker and butter cookies. So if somebody's allergic to peanut butter, I would go for the butter cookies. Unless you're allergic to milk, then I wouldn't go for anything. I would go for the punch bowl. Anyway, we have venue. The venue could be at an arcade. Could be at a festival a wagon house stable, or a forest reservation or preservation. I think it's a preservation center. And then the flowers could be roses, because that would be easy to pick up as a store. Um, we have a dress code would be business casual, black tie affair, or cocktail entire. We have the gift registry, um, would be the site called Over the Moon. Has a lot of like baby shower registries and wedding registry forms and stuff. The wedding dress will be made out of an organza type material, so it's gonna look kind of like a like a prom dress or like one of those um, like crate fold dresses. It's gonna look like it has wrinkles in it or something. <laughs> I always hate organza. It's hard to work with. But organza kind of looks like crepe paper. Until, like, it's folded in the right direction. I feel like if you know how to do, like, an origami type of thing with the designs on wedding dresses, it looks really good. But if it's a cheap wedding dress, it's gonna look really, like, like, party city. Like, ugh. Halloween costume. So hopefully it's an expensive one so that you don't <laughs> look like you have weird shadows on your dress or something. It's it's not a good look. Um, so mishaps at this wedding could be power outage or cold feet or both. I feel like the power outage, somebody thinks it's a sign from God or something. Oh my gosh. Like, if you're in a forest preservation center, I don't think it's going to be a problem. You'll look like a tree. But I feel like somebody doesn't know if they're making the right decision. So if you have cold feet, it's not the right decision. If you don't and there's a power outage and you think it's a sign from God, it's not. It's just that the fucking shit isn't working correctly. And you might have to reevaluate what you want out of life. I feel like if you're not going into... A wedding with the right mindset about what you want and your long-term goals might not be um, alike or channeling correctly. It might not be the right one for you. So anyway, 
I feel like whoever goes to this wedding is gonna be like, uh, what the hell is this? It's gonna be almost like a, um, Phantom of the Opera. It's like a yes, no type of thing. So it could happen for most people. But for a lot of people, it might be like the cold feet fi feature where somebody might just have like a celebration. You know, I don't know. It just could be a lot going on. Uh, somebody doesn't know if it's a yes or a no. Like they were excited about the perception of a wedding, not the actual wedding itself. Or the promises and the loyalty commitment thing. So anyway, hopefully you like this. If you did, leave a like. Um, subscribe if you like these type of readings. And I will be doing this until January or February. <laughs> it depends. I need more paper. That's my problem. But um, hopefully you like this. Hopefully you got something out of it. I know a lot of these themes are a little bit out there. But a lot of people like these. Um, so I'm going to keep doing them. And then, you know, we'll see what happens. Anyway, I'll see you later. Bye.